Hey there, it's Lessa from the product team, and I'm super excited to show you Jason AI, the first B2B conversational AI assistant. So what we can do with its help? Well, first, I'm going to show you how you can create a whole sequence with just one sentence. You summarize the goal of your sequence, and Jason AI is going to craft that email for you. Looks great. Let's move forward. And we see that not only the first step email is crafted, but also all the follow ups. And we can see that those could be email steps or also LinkedIn or other types of steps. Another thing you can do is handle your replies received as a result of the sequence with our JSON AI assistant. So what you can do is provide some context, connect your meeting booking service. And after that, you go to your inbox and you can see a bunch of AI drafts generated that you can just read through and hit send. Another thing I want to drag your attention to is our smart categorization. So you got different types of categories. Our AI assistant will place the received email in so you can tend to those with the meeting intent or the ones that are interested first. And we also have this inbox on the level of the sequence. So you don't have to kind of go different places. You can also just see here everything that you need. And this is how an AI generated draft looks like. Another thing we can offer is improving your own copy. So if you come to us with your own templates, all you need to do is, for instance, improve current texts with AI. And again, JSON AI will take all the points you have mentioned, take your copy and just try to make it better. Uh, and here on the right, you can see the chance to receive a response, which is another great AI feature we have within JSON AI that helps you to kind of see what's missing and what you can do to have a higher chance to receive a response. And you can see the, the spam word count, for instance, call, you might want to rephrase it, say, let's book a meeting and things like this. And lastly, once you've set up your sequence and you have wrote, written your copy, you can see that you can add uh, contacts to your uh, sequence with the help of data. Data is kind of a big uh, bulk of information we have on different, different types of contacts that you can filter out. You can reveal their details if you're interested in them and you can place them directly to your sequence. I hope that was useful. Thanks a lot for checking us out.